Oh, just a quick one for you guys today. I hurt my back, so being vertical is just not a good idea. Let's talk about stock footage. If you're new here, my name's Jay. I make videos about how to make better videos. So if that sounds like something you're into, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell so you can get notified when I upload something new. All right, let's talk about stock footage. For those of you who don't know, stock footage is supplemental footage that you can purchase, download from the internet, using your own videos when you don't have the time or the equipment to get that shot. I've used stock footage a whole bunch. My defending B-roll video, I had some stock footage on there. The video that you hopefully watched this past Friday had stock footage footage in there. My very first like short creative thing, No Life Without Art, which is in my short films playlist, that was 100% stock footage with just a voiceover on top of it. And if you've been watching YouTube recently, you might have noticed that there's a lot of creators being sponsored by a company called Storyblocks, which is an amazing, amazing resource for stock footage and After Effects templates and a whole bunch of other stuff. It is a premium site. And if you're like me and you operate on a zero budget, you may not be able to afford it. Which brings me to why I'm making this video. I wanted to show you guys the three sites that I go to in order to find stock footage for my videos. The sites are 100% free. Some of them do have paid versions, but they all have free resources on them, free stock footage. Some of them even have a couple free After Effects templates, which is super cool. Just a couple of things to keep in mind when you're looking for stock footage. First is the resolution. You want to make sure that the resolution of your stock footage matches the resolution of your video. So if you have a 1080p video, you want to find some 1080p stock footage or some 4K stock footage and just scale it down. If you find something that's maybe like a 720 clip, you're going to have to scale it up and it's not going to look very good. The other thing you have to pay attention to is the license. Every piece of stock footage comes with a license. Sometimes that license says that you can use it when Whenever you want personal or commercial use you don't have to give attribution to the creator it's just your it's your clip to keep other times you have to give attribution to the creator but you can use it anywhere you want and it's still other times you can only use it for personal projects so you have to pay close attention to the license that comes with your clip that you're downloading and with that let's jump into the sites that I use in order to find free stock footage the first site is a site called VidEasy, which is probably the closest thing to a story blocks alternative that you're gonna find it's got photos it's got videos it's got after Effects templates. It's got a whole bunch of stuff. There is a premium version of it, but if you just are looking for free footage, you're going to find a ton. The next site is called Pixabay, which is actually a fairly well-known site. It does have a premium version. I use the free version. It's got a ton of videos and photos, illustrations, vectors, all just all sorts of stuff that you can use for your videos. And the third site is called Pexels, and this is primarily a stock photo site, but it does have videos as well. This was actually actually the very first site that I found when I first started creating videos that had fairly high quality stock footage. Pixabay and VidEasy also have super high quality stuff, but just I got a special place in my heart for Pexels because it was, it was my first. Now I'm sure I don't have to tell you this, but paying for a premium site like Storyblocks is not a bad idea, and that's not the point of this video. Getting into a premium site is gonna give you higher quality footage and a bigger selection, but in a pinch, if you just can't afford to pay for premium stock footage, these three sites should do just fine. And one last bonus site for you guys to check out. If you're interested in making money with stock footage, I invite you to sign up for Black Box Global. It's a place where you can upload your stock footage once and it'll farm it out to all the paid stock footage sites and you can start getting paid for all of your unused footage. Black Box is actually the way that I make the bulk of my money. So it's not a bad idea and it's super easy. If you guys are interested in checking out these free stock footage sites, I will have them linked in the description below as well as the link to Black Box Global. The link 
to Black Box Global is a referral link. So if you do click on it and you sign up, I will make just a little bit of money. So, you know, thank you in advance. And with that, like this video if you enjoyed it, share it if you think your friends will enjoy it, and don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell if you haven't done so already. I will be back on Wednesday for the live stream, but until then, thanks for hanging out, and I'll talk to you later. See ya.